Welcome to today's edition of MQTT Monday. Let's talk about shared subscriptions. Shared subscriptions are one of my favorite features of MQTT 5. This mechanism allows client load balancing, which means that multiple MQTT clients can consume from a topic as one virtual client. With this syntax, shared subscriptions are defined. As you can see, in the first part, we identify a shared subscription. In the second part, the group for the shared subscription is identified. And then we have the actual topic. Now, all members of this shared subscription group will receive messages on that topic in an alternating fashion. You can check out this animation to understand what I'm talking about. Now, when would you want to be using shared subscriptions? Typically, shared subscriptions are best used when you have a specific topic over which a large amount of clients send data and a single client is not capable of processing the data. If you want to, for example, write the data on a topic to a database, it is very possible that the database write takes longer than the message rate. And to combat that, you add multiple MQT clients that write to the same database and that share the topic so that you can write all of the incoming messages at the time that they are received. In next week's MQTT Monday, we will be talking about payload format description. Make sure to subscribe to our channel.